Hi guys, how are you guys doing? Welcome back to my channel and um, this is Renee's Views and Renee's Views we talk about everything fragrance, everything uh, smelling good on a you know on a budget and um, it's just everything fun basically. So today it's going to be another fragrance review and this time I'll be reviewing a fragrance that's relatively new on the market um, and it is a Masouf Musk. Although a lot of people say it's by Adal Zafaran, but it's not. It's from a different house, which I can't really put my hand to at the moment. So this is the fragrance. It comes in the normal signature Masouf uh, pouch. This time this is white and um, the bottle also uh, comes uh, like this. It is halfway frosted white and then it's a little bit uh, transparent at the top. This writing is totally different from the normal Musuf that we know. I know I've seen this before, uh, you know, from this house. It's called Shuyuk or something. I, I'm not really certain. But this house also produced um, another type of uh, Musuf Wardi. They've got another Musuf Wardi. And then I think they also produced uh, Musuf Aswad or something. Anyways, we're talking about this fragrance, which is Musuf Musk. Now, Musuf Musk is your... Uh, soapy, musky, obviously, because musk is like the baseline of this fragrance. It is slightly citrusy. It's a little bit earthy. You know, it's a clean, clean fragrance. Now, upon spraying this fragrance, what first of all hits you is the soapiness. You get something that's soapy. It's like super soapy and musky at the beginning of the fragrance. And then as it you know starts drying down, you start getting whiffs and hints of something that smells, you know, like something herbal, a little bit, you know, earthiness and earthiness just comes in. So I'm guessing this fragrance will have, you know, some patchouli in it. It smells slightly woody as well. And then obviously the musk. The musk in here is, you know, like the game player, although the musk is not in your face kind of musky this is your toned down uh slightly sweet and soapy musk this is a very clean girl scent like if you're looking for a summer scent that's clean this will definitely do it for you it is clean it is slightly um, earthy it is soapy i smell a little bit of florals in it i'm guessing this should have like you know a little bit of um jasmine although the notes are not listed, but that's what I'm getting from this fragrance. And um, yeah, when it starts to dry down, it starts getting a little bit powdery, you know, it starts to get a little bit powdery, but it's not really, really powdery. So this is your typically clean, earthy, slightly floral, soapy and citrusy fragrance. Um, it, 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 you know, it performs above average, this performs uh, like over five hours on my skin and uh, almost pushing the 12-hour mark on my clothes. Um, it's not really beast mode, but it smells really good. It smells elegant. You know, these are for, this is for the days that you don't want to put on something heavy. You want to smell good, but not overpower um, the atmosphere wherever you go this is like your you just want to quickly get some groceries you want to go out you want to something to grab on the go this is an easy you know easy reach fragrance that will not um choke anyone out that will not um uh offend anyone in your space so it's a it's a nice one it is okay <laughs> it's not really be slow but it's it's okay it's a nice musky fragrance that you know you could wear for everyday wear every time so yeah that's uh, basically all i have to say about the fragrance so thank you guys for joining me today and let's meet in the comment section let me know if you'll be getting this fragrance if you've used it what you think about it you know if you have any other fragrance you'd like me to review um, if you haven't done that already, kindly subscribe to the channel and um, I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.